Members of the government paid homage to statesman, visionary leader, nation builder and Jamaica's second prime minister, Sir Donald Sangster, on Monday, October 26, the anniversary of Sir Donald's birthday. According to Prime Minister Andrew Holness, Sir Donald Sangster was one of the architects of Jamaica's economy. It was his vision that drove the establishment of Jamaica's second international airport, which is today named after him. And the Donald Sangster International um, Airport is one of the largest airports in the Caribbean. And um, that is the airport that continues to buttress our tourism industry. Today, I wish to announce that through the Ministry of Culture, Gender, Entertainment, and Sport, Sir Donald Sangster's family home just outside of Mountainside in St. Elizabeth will be restored as a national heritage site. Mr. Honus says, though the COVID-19 has impacted the Jamaican economy, the government has been implementing measures to be able to respond effectively to certain shocks without having to borrow due to fiscal management and planning. I want to be frank with the Jamaican people. The pandemic has affected our economy in significant ways. It has impacted the business community in significant ways. And uh, we hear the calls constantly about opening up. Jamaica has never closed. We have been very strategic in how we reconfigure, how we conduct our business so that we can control the spread and not have a worst kind of impact on our economy. The Prime Minister also underscored the importance of building resilience and for all Jamaicans to work together to allow Jamaica to recover any economic shocks it may experience.